So you might think that Andriy Vasilenko was the first Metallica YouTuber, but actually, it was me. Now you might be thinking I'm just BSing you because my channel was created two years ago while his was nine years ago. But let's check out my other channel and this will be the first video you're going to see. That's right kids, you can have more than one YouTube channel. And when you compare the dates, then yeah. So never assume anything based on the date joined by any YouTube channel. I've seen a few hundred K sub channels that said, oh, that was their fifth channel or something. And I believe a lot of people just private the old and bad videos and just leave the good ones out there. I actually wanted that Misfits piano cover to be my first video on that channel. But I didn't know or care about the Misfits. I only liked that song that Metallica did a cover of. Even though it's really random and I cannot say Motor Breath was my favorite song at that time, but I just wanted the first thing people see was Metallica. But I have videos even older than this one where I have Metallica stuff inside. Let's go back to my other other channel. So for my very first YouTube channel created in 2011, I had a lot of Metallica songs as the background music for my Dota gameplay. There are a lot of Maroon 5 songs and older stuff and then I slowly like put a lot of hit songs like Tyro Cruise because that was popular during that time in like the 2013 era. Then for Metallica, of course I used the studio versions of the songs but even sometimes I used the demos. I remember Battery and Master of Puppets, I used those demos for the songs sometimes. Not because I wanted to evade the copyright but it's just I don't want to reuse the same songs then okay the demo is really cool and now i'm realizing i didn't listen to a demo in a long time during that time in 2013 i was really into like listening just the vocals just the guitar and all the demos that kind of thing so i'm the first one where's my freaking cookie but the idea for a metallica channel only came in like 2013 or 14 but i really wish i started at that time it'll be really interesting but i guess it wouldn't last long because i grew out of metallica in like 2015 or something so like and subscribe that's it